channel so i thought i would do a little vlog or like a few day vlog um for my next video because if you didn't know in the uk we've gone back into lockdown so like the second lockdown it's supposed to be four weeks so it ends on like the second of december or something like that um is it really gonna end then who knows but i thought i'd do sort of like a day in my life in lockdown to show you that i really don't do much at all um because i can't work at the moment because i work in a pub and they're all shut and just to kind of show you like realistic so that if there's anyone who is feeling really down about this and they're kind of sat doing nothing that it's okay and that we're kind of a lot of us are in the same position so um these might be quite boring but they are realistic i've just got what time is it it's quarter to 11 so i've got up i've had breakfast i've got ready um because i'm about to go on a little walk so i have actually written my to-do list um i've been doing this i've got quite a few things on but some of them are just really small um like one of them is going outside which is what i will be doing in a bit um some of them and some of them like i've put on there tight in my mirror because my mirror is loose it's annoying me and i know i'll forget if i don't put it on there so if i put it on there i'll actually do it um so i have got to post a depop parcel as well so i've just packaged that up so i'm gonna go down to the post office and post that and then after i've done that i'm gonna like just continue going on a walk unless it's like actually tipping it down um which actually hasn't happened too much recently um if it's like tipping it down i will typically just stay inside all day because i don't really see the point of um going on a rainy walk personally but um i have been trying to expect like it, i like doing it in the morning time because it does something to fill my mornings is going out on a little walk or a bike ride um i just kind of choose what i want to do depending on how i'm feeling and what the weather's like so today um i was just sort of feeling a walk so i am going to go do that sometimes my walks will take me up until like what i would call my lunch time so then it kind of just really fill my whole morning i've also re resolved to watching grey's Anatomy me um again for like the fourth time um <coughs> so the new why am i so zoomed in so the new season, season 17, has just started coming out. If you haven't seen it, I might mention spoilers in this little section. But oh my god, <laughs> I can't wait for the next episode next week. And that's the thing, as I kind of, um, I'm kind of glad that they're out weekly because then it kind of like I don't binge watch it all in one, whereas I normally would do. So that's that i'm gonna do a quick outfit of the day even though it's really boring so i actually did get ready today some days i won't get ready like i'll get ready but i'll just put comfy clothes on i won't wear any makeup and that's as far as we'll go um but i have actually got jeans on because i was like if i'm going out let's put it on it also helps sometimes to do it because um especially when i've got a few things to do because it makes me feel more productive and it makes me actually feel like i want to do those things so we've got basic outfits, so we've got this pink jumper which seems to feature in like all my videos recently. So if you've <laughs> watched my last video I know this is just from a charity shop and probably my video before that because I think it was in that too. And then um, these are just black jeans from Topshop and I just have a white t-shirt on underneath. And I'll probably wear my coat and my wellies because it has been raining so it'll probably be muddy. So I'm going to go and post this and then go and walk. So I just got back from my walk and um, one of the things I have on my to-do list is to like try like, Google Photos because I want to find a better way to store my photos for like storage and purpose and stuff. And I just uploaded to um, into one of my Google, Google accounts um, and there's actually already photos in there and they're just all um, old YouTube banners that I made. I just thought it was funny to look at it. Like this one has got my old 
when I did like beauty, 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 beauty and makeup. It's got my old Instagram account and the profile picture and like old pictures. I don't know how to zoom out now, God. And then there's this one, which is cute. <laughs> and this one, what I put underneath it, new videos every Wednesday at 6 p.m. I guess that's when I used to upload. And then there's also this one. <laughs> Last month I spent a week with my heart in New York. In LA it changed, you feel so much further than ever before. I watched the lines all blurring far between the places that just had these Muji pens come in the post. I thought I was expecting the package for my nose rings. Um, these weren't supposed to come for ages, but I'm so excited because they look so nice. I've never used these pens before, but people said they're really good and I genuinely have no other black pens. Like, so now I have these, which really excites me um, because I love really nice black pens. So that is great. Ooh. So I'm just going to test them out and then I am going to patch up some marks um, on my wall. So I have, I've done this before because I spilt coffee on my wall and it's just, I've got this that I did by accident that I want to paint over. And then my lovely boyfriend spilt coffee up here and the only way that you can remove it is by painting over it because if you try to wipe it off with water the paint wipes off too so I need to paint over that as well and I think I've got like one next to my window too so um I've just had lunch as well so that is what time is it five to two so that is the beginning of the afternoon task let's go try these pens I'm so excited stationery excites me so much So it looks really bad at the moment, but I've just like patched up the bits on the wall. I will need more than one coat, but generally it doesn't dry like this. It really blends in from when I've done it before. So that's pretty nice. So I've just got to wait for it to dry before I can do more coats. So I was going to say I'll use my nice new pen to cross it off, but I haven't actually done it yet. So I'm not going to cross it off. Um, but I just have a few other things so in my google photos it's still actually backing all of them up it's got like um 1960 left or something um so i can't sort that out yet i might plan my video content because then i get to use these um so i think i'm gonna do that doing all of the bits of painting and I also made like a little calendar type thing for December and my Google photos is still backing them all up it's got nearly a thousand left so hopefully it'll do that soon um so now it's like 20 past three so I am actually going to go and play some piano so um when I was younger I actually had lessons and I actually properly learned but I never got to like a grade or anything and I've always loved it and like loved music and stuff so I was like within this lockdown I'm going to try and like properly pick it back up again so I have been trying to learn a song and um, I've been trying to practice every day just for like half an hour or so um, and I've also been trying to practice sight reading because it's my bass clef that I'm not as good at, treble clef I'm pretty fluent but um 
base cap is what I need to work on so we are going to be working on that. <laughs> Tuesday even though it probably won't be a Tuesday when you watch this I mean it could be so you would have already seen this morning um, I got up and I went on a bike ride and I've just had a shower and it is now actually like 12 o'clock um, I really don't have much to do today so as you can see this is a lockdown day where I'm not wearing makeup I'm not ready I'm wearing <laughs> Joggers, oh, my battery's flashing, and unicorn socks. So last time I filmed, oh, I've got something on the lens. The camera cut out. Because the battery died. So I like put it on charge until it fully charged. So I've got back to you now. So I think I was, last time I was saying it was like 12. It's now nearly three o'clock. Um, basically, um, what I was saying I was doing is having a day where I'm really not doing much at all, which is very realistic for lockdown. Um, but I am, after yesterday, putting all my photos into Google Photos. In Google Photos, it gives you 15 gigabytes free. I used, like, nearly all the 15. So, I went through all of my photos again and deleted a load of them again and then I also I think videos is my main issue and I've managed to get it down to I think it's on like 10 gigabytes maybe 10 gigabytes 10 10 and a half gigabytes used currently so I was like I need to go through all my concert videos so I also did that um because every time I'd go and sort out videos I'd skip over the concert videos because I was like I don't want to delete any of them but some of them were literally pure like pure shit basically like they were pointless videos you couldn't even see the person who was supposed to be in it um so I had a lot of fun looking through all of my concert videos um so now I'm gonna go back through the videos in general because I still want to get less because the point was of putting all my photos Google Photos. I currently pay 79p to get extra storage on my phone and it's mainly just because of, of the amount of photos that I had. And I know 79p isn't that much but it would be quite nice to not have to pay that um, potentially. So that's why I put them onto Google Photos and then to get 100 gigabytes a month it's like £1.79 on Google Photos so I don't want to have to do that either. I just want to be able to keep them under 15 gigabytes which should be doable. I don't know but that way I could just pay 79p, have extra on here, but then also have them on Google Photos. Big Google Photos ramble, but that's basically what I've been doing. I've had some lunch as well, and just, that's as interesting as it's going to get. I also started watching the series The Crown on Netflix because people, like I kept seeing about the new season that come out about Princess Diana, and I'm like really interested in... Um, the story of all of that and I was just going to watch the season 4 um, but I decided I'll start from the beginning and watch it all and I didn't think I'd find it interesting but I actually think it's quite good you really step up to the plate and create something that deserves its place in a history anywhere in the world but any of our four big
Hello everyone, so welcome back to this lockdown vlog. Um, but today is like a really not nice day. Like I woke up and it was raining and I haven't felt, I don't even have much to do. This is one of the lockdown days where it's just not great. Um, so I've been sat, it's like 12 I think now. I've literally been, like I've got up late and I've been sat watching it catching up on the bake off, bake off from last night this morning I've only just now like got dressed but I'm still in leggings and a hoodie I just got out of my pajamas just so I felt a little bit better like it's just it's not like tipping it down now but it's just not exactly the nicest day so I think because I haven't like been out it's like made me feel really unproductive because I would have like probably either still be out by now like on a walk or something or like just got back um, and I don't really want to do that because it's probably just going to rain again and it's just, it just doesn't look very nice. What if all this counts for nothing? Everything I thought I'd be. What if I... Just, well, I've only done one hand, but I thought so because I think it looks really nice. I've just painted my nails with this um, Barry M nail varnish in the shade Peanut Butter. So I've just received a parcel in the post and it is my nose rings so that means that i get to change my piercing um so oh god i just got stuck on my freshly painted nails um i got it pierced in like august i think august august or september um but i was allowed to change it like the weekend gone like it would be three months exact um but i had a had a keloid on it before and I had it come back. It was really annoying and I said I wasn't gonna let myself change it if I still had it because I wanted it to be like properly healed. I wouldn't say it is, it's probably gonna take like a full year to obviously properly heal it because that's just always how piercings work. But because it's not sore and it doesn't have the keloid on it, I don't mind changing it. So I got these from the brand La Visa. I've never got them from like any jewelry or anything from them before. Um, but I like this packaging, it's quite nice. So I basically just got three, they're all um, gold because I'm just a gold jewelry person. I basically got three of the pack, it was like a, a nose set. So currently, I don't necessarily want to show you up my nose, but I've got, it's just a straight stud and it's like a, uh, like a, it's like curved, it's like, this is basically the ones I got. The one I'm wearing now is like the one in the middle. And then this is the one I'm planning to put in. Um, I've never actually fully, fully, fully pulled this out before. I've only done it like back to in the shower. I'm really scared. I do have um, some salt water to like clean the hole afterwards. I need to do actually. I mean, it's pretty much out. It's on the end of my nose. Oh my God, pushing it out. Can I come out on that? Really hurt. It's like a fish hook. It's been a bit traumatic. But I managed to get the one with the ball in. Um, apart from I can't connect the thing up, so I've just pushed it so you can't see it. I don't like this one, um, but it's now stuck on my nose and my nose hurts, so I'm just going to try again tomorrow. I'm <laughs> so zoomed in. So, this is the one that we're sticking with for now. Hello everyone, I can't remember what I last vlog of the nose pacing situation, but I've managed to get the hoop in, the hoop that I want in, but... This is going to be some up close nostril bit. It doesn't actually go around my whole nose. It like stops here. And I don't know why it's so short. But I'm just going to leave it now. Because it's the best one that I've got in. So. 